Mark Cuban is close to selling a significant share of the NBA's Dallas Mavericks. It's according to our friends over at ESPN. And with advanced talks involving the billionaire entrepreneur and the casino-owning Adelson family, let's take a look at the potential huge deal by the numbers. $3.5 billion, that's the reported valuation range of the agreement to sell a major stake in the NBA franchise. But Cuban would remain governor of the Mavericks and control all basketball decisions. The Adelson family is selling almost $2 billion in stock in the Las Vegas Sands Corporation to, quote, fund the purchase of the majority interest in the pro sports franchise. That's according to an SEC filing. That would mean the Adelsons could acquire at least 57% of the Mavs if the entire $2 billion goes toward the purchase. Cuban has owned the franchise since 2000, where he purchased a, a major share for a price tag of $285 million, and he took the team to an NBA title in 2011. The outspoken 65-year-old has also gained fame from the hit ABC show Shark Tank, which he has said recently he plans to leave after the 16th season airs next year. So who are the Adelsons? 78-year-old Miriam Adelson is the widow of casino magnet and former GOP mega donor Sheldon Adelson. She's currently the fifth richest woman in the world with an estimated net worth of $32.3 billion. That's according to Forbes. And if the sale goes through, Adelson would become just the third woman to serve as a current principal owner of an NBA franchise. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.